According to the ASPCA, approximately 6.3 million companion animals enter U.S. shelters every year. And with inflation predicted to stay at unusually high rates in 2023, many local shelters are fearing for the future. For many, pets are family. Perfect. Perfect match. I'm so glad we have Kyle. But adding a furry friend to the family can be expensive. And for some, the cost is too much to bear. We get between 10 and 12 surrenders per week, you know, so we're looking at anywhere between 30, 30 and 50 a month. Pet surrenderers and abandoned animals are creating a big challenge right now for animal shelters all across Montana. These four puppies were recently dumped near a river in eastern Montana. Six of their siblings were also found, but have since been adopted. You could see like the remnants of the box and the bowl of food that they try to leave out for them when they dump them. And as sad as it is, stories like this are far too common. We've seen people tie dogs to our dumpster, tie them to the front door, tie them to the bench. We've seen some, pre some pretty sad things, honestly. According to a recent study by Best Friends Animal Society, more than two thirds of U.S. households share their homes with cats and dogs. But in 2021, 4.6 million cats and dogs entered U.S. animal shelters. <laughs> Ashley Burling from Help for Homeless Pets believes the pandemic and the economy play a large role in the high rate of animals currently being abandoned. I think inflation, um, I think people going to work after the pandemic, um, you know, there's other reasons that they're surrendered. When you're talking about inflation, you're talking about vet bills and pet food and pet supplies and, and pet rent. But fortunately, there are angels like Megan Will You ready to help. The cost of pet ownership, well worth it. Oh, 100%. <laughs> 100% worth it. An unbreakable bond, no matter the price. That, you can't put a price on that. In Billings, Kelsey Marison, MTN News.